students welcome to my youtube channel i'm going to solve this question which is which is given here that 1 upon x plus 4 minus 1 upon x minus 7 equals to 11 by 30 and we have to find the value of x here so we will start from the left hand side we will take its lcm so you know here in this case lcm will be product of these both denominators so x plus 4 into x minus 7 is the lcm now when we divide this x plus 4 and this x plus 4 and x minus 7 so we'll get here x minus 7 minus when we divide this numerator by this denominator by this denominator so here we are getting x minus x plus 4 equals to 11 by 30 now next is to solve this so we will open the bracket here and before bracket minus sign is here so both the sign will change here we will get here minus x minus 4 and here we will multiply so we are using the identity here x plus a into x plus b so directly you will get here x square minus 3x minus 28 by using the identity or you can multiply these both both the way you will get the same result so now here in the numerator plus x and minus x they cancel each other minus 7 minus 4 is minus 11 minus 11 over x square minus 3x minus 28 equals to 11 by 30 now this 11 11 also which are both in the numerator cancel each other here we will have minus 1 and then we cross multiply it so when we cross multiply we will get x square minus 3x minus 28 equals to minus 30 this minus 30 will come to left hand side so we will get here x square minus 3x minus 28 plus 30 equal to 0 so when we add these we will get 2 so x square minus 3x plus 2 equal to 0 now we will because this is a quadratic equation now so we will solve by middle term splitting it is easy so and middle term splitting by middle terms we will get here minus 2x minus x plus 2 equal to 0 so these two are the factors which are getting by middle term splitting so now there are two pairs here from first pair we will take x common so it is x minus 2 and from second pair we will get minus 1 common so again we are getting x minus 2 so when we we'll solve it x minus 2 and x minus 1 equal to 0 these are the factors so to find the zeros we will equate them to 0 so we will get here x minus 2 equal to 0 or x minus 1 equal to 0 so from here x equals to 2 and x equals to 1 these are the two values of x here x equals to 2 and 1 